Hello and welcome back to our channel. I am Shiraz and you're watching Currency Corner, YouTube channel. Hopefully you all will be fine. Let's start today information. On Thursday, Kazim Altoy, a member of the Parliamentary Committee on Oil, Gas and Natural Resources, confirmed that the draft oil and gas law is currently pending approval in the Council of Ministers. The joint committees from the federal and regional governments continue their collaborative efforts to finalize the legislation. Sources suggest that the law may soon be presented for a vote, potentially as early as Sunday. Intel from Bruce Hintz at Weekend Appointments, Intel guru Bruce reports new updates indicating that the anticipated start for Tier 4 exchanges and appointments is approaching quickly. According to Bruce, sources within the Treasury involved in preparations suggest that the process is only a day or two away from beginning, with the weekend looking promising for notifications. BRICS Summit 2024 No new currency announcement The ongoing BRICS Summit in Russia has not yet led to the expected announcement of a new currency. According to Sandy Ingram, while many anticipated a currency development at the summit, the current outlook does not suggest any immediate plans. Further updates on the summit's outcomes are expected on Saturday. Kurdistan payroll delays persist amid internal review sources from the Kurdistan region's Ministry of Finance, revealed that October's payroll list has not yet been sent to Iraq's Ministry of Finance in Baghdad, a step required for verification before funds can be transferred. The ministry plans to send the list later this week, but the verification and fund transfer processes are expected to delay salary payments for employees in the Kurdistan region until early November. The delay has been attributed to internal reviews. While Iraq's Ministry of Finance has committed to auditing the payroll as soon as the list is received, the chronic nature of these delays has caused ongoing distress for employees who rely on timely salary payments for their daily needs. Despite federal court acknowledgement of the government's obligation to pay salaries regularly, payment issues persist. Many residents facing these frequent delays are resorting to borrowing to meet basic needs, leading to rising debt and social and economic pressures, 